Hello, we're Chris and Lydia, an empty nest travelling couple from Australia. Welcome to our adventure filled day in Dubai, touring around the city's iconic landmarks, cooling off with some fun in the snow, believe it or not, before wrapping up the day with a VIP trip to the top of the tallest building in the world for an amazing sunset. Stay tuned to see if our VIP experience was really worth the price. And it's time to start the day with a coffee. There's our hotel, Swiss hotel. And there's the Burj, which we will be climbing this afternoon. I don't know about climbing. I think we might go up in the lift. Yeah. This can climb. If he wants to climb the stairs, I think there'd be quite a few stairs. I don't know, there'd be a few daredevils that would try it. So we're just about to go on the hop on hop off bus of Dubai today. There's got two options. Um, we're thinking we're going to go on the red one, but you'll find out what we decide or if someone wants to give us a better deal, we might go on the other one. We've decided on the big bus tour, hop on hop off. There's two types. There's the big bus and there's also this one here, Sightseeing Dubai. But the big bus gave us 15% off because we're flying Emirates. And there's two routes. There's the red line that takes us to the old town and the blue line that takes us to the marina area and the palm. So anyway, there's a few hours, even if we just stay on the bus and don't get off. We've got lots of time, you can get a two day pass, but our one day pass cost us 300 dirham each, uh, minus 15%. So that's uh, 255 each. We've come to yet another mall. This one is the Mall of the Emirates. My legs are hurting just thinking about it. <laughs> But we haven't come here shopping, We've come here for another reason. Welcome to Ski Dubai. This is actually man made ski slopes and toboggan slopes inside the Mall of the Emirates. Outside it's over 30 degrees and in here it's freezing. It's so good. <laughs> Just having a hot fight. This is amazing. <laughs> Alright, let's do some tobogganing. We're going to go on a tube ride. A bit tamer than the Zorba ball. Going up the chairlift because there's a hot chocolate waiting for us at the other at end. The I think we're cold enough now to feel like a hot chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's nice and warm in here. Thank you very much. Hot chocolate. Cheers. My 
kids beating up any now and getting cold. <laughs> Look, that's a shopping centre there. All those windows are shops and restaurants. restaurants and whatnot. And they're all looking at us ski and have fun. And we feel like a bit of like a fish in an aquarium. A snow globe. You like it? <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's go. Bye ski well. Bye ski well. Till next time. Oh, back out into the heat. <laughs> About to get back on the big red bus again. We started at the Dubai Mall and the Burj Khalifa here and we came along the Blue Route to the Mall of the Emirates and we're now going to drive around Dubai Marina area where the Dubai Eye Ferris wheel is. Then we'll drive out to the end of the Palm Jumeirah before heading back to Dubai Mall for lunch. After a quick lunch in one of Dubai Moor's many eateries, it was soon time to hop back on the bus again. This afternoon we're going to jump back on the big red bus and do the red route. So this takes us out through Old Dubai, past the old souks, and along Dubai Creek. Uh, Dubai Airport's out this way as well, just outside the border of the map here. Big red bus arrived back at Dubai Mall just in time for our 5pm ticket slot to ascend the Burj Khalifa. We're just waiting in line to go up the Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world. We're going up to floor 148. Uh, hopefully we'll be there when it sunsets. It's only about an hour and a half till sunset. Got our tickets. 148 floors up. Tallest building in the world, and it's as thin as a pencil. <laughs> We're in the Sky Lounge, uh, which is like a VIP lounge, waiting to go up. It is a special ticket to go up to 148, and a normal ticket, a uh, cheaper ticket only goes up to floor 125. Um, so there's a lot fewer people spend the extra little bit of money to go up to 148. Um, so we're hoping that it's worthwhile, but we'll see. <laughs> Bit of a hike just to get to the lift, isn't it?
welcome to 148. This is our open balcony over there. Okay. Thank you. desert there still to develop. I think there's a lone skyscraper over <laughs> there. To buy mall down there. Shows you how, how big a footprint it takes. It's a great view. It's a lot of desert out there still. Heaps of room to keep expanding. Mm. Coffees and dates. Are they dates? And treats. That's a nice little extra. Down on floor one, two, five now, and really the view is not that much different. It's now going dark, so it's a little bit different for us because the lights are on now. This is floor one, two, four. The outside viewing area it is a lot more crowded than up on one, four, eight. You've got to fight for a position next to the window to see out here. And just like that, we're down. Certainly went down a lot faster than we came up. My ears are popping. Back in the room now. Coming down, when we went to come down, we turned the corner and just went, oh my goodness, the lines to get back down were horrendous. And we went, oh, we've got a VIP sticker. <laughs> we just had to get in this little short line and we were on the next lift. So even for that was in our opinion, worth it because we were tired. It's been a long day and we're just like, I couldn't imagine standing in line for, you know, an hour and a half to get on a lift to go back down again. So for that, it's, I think, worth it. It was twice the price of just going up to mm. the 125th floor, but certainly having less crowds and not having to wait in line two hours mm. just to get up in the first place. Yeah. I think it was certainly worth the price. So it was about $220 each it cost us. Australian. Australian. But overall, it's been a really good day. Um, exhausting day. <laughs> we pack as much in as we possibly could. If you like our video today, please hit like and subscribe. And see where we turn up tomorrow. Let's good night, everyone. Good night. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come roving with us again next week on our last day in Dubai where we catch the metro to old Dubai and then explore Dubai Marina. And please subscribe to help support our channel and leave a comment to let us know where in the world you're from. <laughs>